Hello, Klaus here. I appreciate all the time you are spending watching my tutorials. So maybe you have done a couple of projects already now in DaVinci Resolve. And the projects you're doing are kind of the similar setup. You need the same setup every time. I want to show you how to save time and how to do a template so you can just hit the template and all of the time use that for your project so you don't have to mess around with the settings every time you do a new project. So without further ado, let's get right to it. Let's go to the editing suite. Oh, and let's have some coffee. Hmm, that is just lovely. Okay, so here we are back in DaVinci Resolve. And first off, let's go up to the preferences here. And let's go to the user settings and go down to the editing. And here we can change the things we want to change. First off, I want to change the start of the time code to zero. And then I want, usually I want two video tracks on the videos I do, and I want four audio tracks as well. And um, we'll just change that. And then I'll go down here. So for this preset, I want to do um, a preset for television, which is in Europe at least, 25 frames a second. So I'll change the 24 to 25, like that. And all that is just nice. And then of course you could uh, change things in the color settings. I'm not going to do that. Also, you could change stuff in Fairlight. Ain't gonna do that. Actually, you can change all the settings as you like. Um, for instance, I can go here in the keyboard mapping and change my uh, Klaus preset to the DaVinci preset, for instance. So, but I think I will, I'll keep the DaVinci preset for this. It's just fine. Okay. Nothing much more to change. So this is like the basic you need to do. And then you go up here to the three dots and um, here we can save our presets as and um, let's call this TV setup. Oh, yeah, let's call, yeah, oh, let's call it 25 as well, 25p, and um, let's go. And then now it's saved, and we'll just save that. So we'll just uh, reboot the DaVinci here. Or you can just push uh, Control um, Shift uh, one, so you can open up your project settings here, and then we'll just start a new project. And I'll just say yes, and let's go up to the preferences. And um, if we go now to the user again, we can go up to the three dots, and we can actually choose the one we want. So let's take the TV one we just did, and just hit save. Let's go into the media tab and let's just find some kind of a clip we'll need. Let's take this old tutorial. And as you see now, when we drop it in, we have two video tracks and four audio tracks. So now you have this as a preset and you never ever have to make that from the beginning again. And then you can just change it if you want to. Anyway, this was just a quick video on how to do a preset in DaVinci Resolve so you don't have to do the settings all of the time and you can change in between different presets as you need it. Okay, I hope you found that useful. If you did, please hit that subscribe button, give the video a like, share it with your friends if you think it will help them out. And if you want to be notified every time there's a new video on the channel, please hit that bell icon down in the corner. Until next time, keep filming, keep learning and keep sharing.